The Republican House Majority Leader will receive his second pay bump in less than a year if he's elected to replace ousted Speaker Kevin McCarthy. House Majority Leader Steve Scalise, Arla, faces an uphill battle to secure the 217 votes he'll need to replace ousted House Speaker Kevin McCarthy, R. Califf. With members of the GOP's right wing threatening to back one of their own in Rep. Jim Jordan, R. Ohio. But the New Orleans native has never run from a fight. Rapidly returning to Congress after he was shot by a left-wing extremist in 2017 and again in September, after announcing he was diagnosed with cancer in August. If Scalise wins his latest bout, he will earn his second pay raise in less than a year, a $30,100 bump from his current $193,400 congressional salary. That would be substantial for the 58-year-old Scalise, whose nearly 30-year government career has yielded him a net worth of about $350,000, according to Forbes's estimates. Born and raised in the bayou, Scalise, the son of a realtor, owes his wealth to the government. Less than seven years after graduating from Louisiana State University, where he served as Speaker of the Student Assembly and volunteered for George H. W. Bush's 1988 presidential campaign, Scalise won a seat in the Louisiana State House of Representatives in 1996. He served 12 years there, then took a state Senate seat in January 2008. A few months later, he was elected to replace the state's former governor Bobby Jindal in the U.S. House of Representatives. Scalise served as whip for the Republican House majority from 2014 to 2018 and held on to that position when the GOP lost control of Congress's lower chamber from 2019 to 2022. This past January, he was elected House Majority Leader. All that government service has left Scalise with a sizable federal pension, by far his largest asset. Thanks to the 15 years he has served in the House, he is currently eligible to collect an estimated $46,000 per year from the federal government for the rest of his life, with annual payouts starting when he turns 62. Forbes estimates that annuity, if Scalise were to sell it today, is worth about $350,000. If he's elected Speaker, his pay will rise to $223,500, which would further boost the value of his pension. A representative for Scalise did not respond to Forbes's requests for comment for this story. Scalise likely also has a smaller state pension from his 12 years of service in the Louisiana House of Representatives, which Forbes estimates will pay out about $600 per month when Scalise turns 60, making it worth only $55,000 today. His only other large asset, a modest home in the same Louisiana parish where he grew up. He's lived there since 1998 when he acquired the property for $119,500 with the help of a $113,525 mortgage. He refinanced that loan in 2013 and took on a second mortgage that same year with an exorbitant 18% interest rate. That brought the total value of the debt secured by Scalise's house to $515,000.